And tomorrow is Polish Constitution Day. We've got some fun ideas on how you can host a festive Polish party. We're back with that and more after the break. It's Polish Constitution Day. And a big day here in Chicago with over a million Polish Americans living here. In fact, Chicago has the second largest Polish population in the world next to the capital of Poland, which of course is Warsaw. So if you're planning to celebrate after the annual parade downtown, we have some great ideas to help make your party festive. So joining us is Basha Brown, host of the Polish TV show Poland on a Plate. Tell, now, tell us what you have. So there is really nothing more Polish than Polish ham. So I have a lot yes. of treats with that. First up is our ham salad in cucumber cups. So it's just like a ham salad, cream cheese, walnuts. We also have ham wrapped around goat cheese and asparagus. Wow, that looks good. And then we Very have nice. our Polish sausage with cherry tomatoes, arugula, and a pickled mushroom. Which a is, pickled mushroom? Is that a yeah, very Polish kind of thing? It is a very Polish thing. So I you get the mushroom and it has a little bit of that pickle flavor too. Okay. What else, um, Basha? Over here, these are potato pancakes, Platsky in Polish. Sure. And they're traditionally served with sour cream, chives, and then we um, have some sausages. They're usually made a little bit bigger, but at Poland on a Plate, what we like to do is have updates on the classic. So I've made mine mini, more like appetizer friendly for a party. I got it. Okay, good. Then good. these are pierogi. Oh. Everyone's so familiar with pierogi. My son just loves pierogies of any kind. What what are these? Are they particular flavor? They're the mixed. Onion or? There's um, sauerkraut, mushroom, meat, and then the ever popular potato and cheese. And then these are sandwiches. In Polish, they're kanapki. Okay. And Polish sandwiches are always open face. And then these we just, I took a little glass to mm -hmm. cut them out to make them smaller. And there's a wide variety of toppings, hard boiled eggs, very Polish. We have the sausage again, asparagus. Very nice. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take one of these guys and just test it. <laughs> And just to make sure it's what you say it is, um, as you go through and tell us about some of the wonderful beverages you brought Yes. Along. Um, so over here we have mm. the Kiss Me on Polish Cosmo. Oh, so really? it's kind of a traditional Cosmo, except we're adding rose liqueur instead of Grand Marnier to give it that authentic Polish rose flavor. Mm -hmm. Then we have the Polish flag shots. Okay. That's cherry liqueur. Topped with vodka. Now I'm not going to have it. I'm just going to smell it here. Just as we'll, I... we'll save that for later. I still have to finish the <laughs> newscast. Okay, I'm not going there. And All then right. um, Charlotka is Polish apple pie. So I've made a drink right here to mimic that. Is Szymborówka is a Polish bison grass vodka, mm -hmm. and then with hard apple cider. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe just a sip. <laughs> and then. Last but not nice. least, we Good. have our Tiska beer, and very popular in Europe is to add a uh, raspberry syrup oh. to the beer. And what is that? Uh, do you like it that way? I like it that way. Okay. I prefer it that way. But Here, oh. I will give you this, and I'll teach you now in Polish to say oh. cheers. Okay, how do you say cheers? We say Nostrovia. Nostrovia. Pasha so. Nastrovia. Now, if somebody's interested in learning more about how you put all this together, we have our recipes available, I yes. believe, on our website, myfoxchicago.com. Right, Karen? Okay, very nice. You can also on our website, Your website, Poland which on a plate. is? PolandOnAPlate.com. Very nice. Basha, nice to meet you. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. I'm not going to need lunch today, that's for sure. <laughs>